वॉसम ऑफ वेल्ड सो बी ऑल हैविंग एन ऑसम डे अब कोई कौन है नेट गैस गोल्ड सिल्वर एंड क्रूड ऑल स्टार्टिंग विद नेचुरल गैस एंड वट डू वी हैव right here so as price is broken above 50 and 20 em and also pushed up nicely out of this bullish engulfer that happens at the trend line and that was also mentioned in my live session with my members and as you can see the price just pushed up and we have now a good push up above 50 and 20 em price is now pulling back down and at this point all i'm waiting for the bullish engulfing pattern so let's save this candle turns to be a bullish engulfer in that case we'll have a valid buy signal and price will likely push up and this is an area from where i'll be expecting a price to push lower again and give us a pullback before the price continue to push higher right here as you can see the number in blue now if that candle turns to be a bullish engulfer my first target will be 1 atr as you can see the atr is 4 so four points initial targets and second targets will be somewhere here and take profit 1 to 1 as well so that's what i'll be looking at bullish engulfer will be mandatory condition targets will be 1 atr and then you can manage it totally up to you if you want to manage it till this recent resistance level so that's what we are getting here on nemex platform and here on capital.com exactly the same bullish and golf for the next candle will be a valid buy signal but it must not be a big candle like this so in that case we'll have a good momentum and if i see a momentum candles a big big candles like this i don't normally go for the trades that is why we need to capture some moves before the price give us next condition and next entry pattern so wait and see if this candle turns to be a bullish engulfer we have likely chance the price will push up from here and my next selling zone here on capital.com is right here which is 3.427 that goes up to 3.633 from where we'll be looking for a counter trend sell trades only so that's what i'll be looking at wait and see how it goes once we have a condition we are good to go for our trades right here no wonder price is still inside the trend continuation bullish area and that is a possible 3a2 candle it is a 3a2 candle that shows a bullish pressure that's kind of had a shoulder pattern as well a minor level if the next candle turns to be a bullish engulfer which is very likely because the previous candle is a very small red candle so it is a chance that next candle turns to be a bullish engulfing pattern if we have that we are good to go long and targets will be 1 to 2 ati initially i'll keep my stop loss below take profit 1 to 1 initially and the next zone to take my count the trend sell trades is right up there 3.130 that goes to 3.287 from where i'll be looking to enter my bearish sell trades for now look for the condition once we have a conditions we are good to go for our long trade once we see a bullish engulfing pattern right here next one we have silver silver has just broken above this little box now ideally i would like to see a break above this high right here and then i start to look for my bullish condition but looking at the range has just been broken we have a chance that silver will start to push higher from here but i will personally go for my long trades once the price break above this high and then a pullback then a bullish engulfing pattern so that's what i'll be looking at right now once we have a condition above this high only then i'm going to go for long but for now my bias is still bullish because we are still above this recent trend continuation level but we can still expect some pullback and range as well it is not a confirmation but a signal that we have we have a bullish pressure so I'll, i won't be entering with this candle i'll be only entering with my bullish engulfer above these highs So we didn't see how it goes and wait with patience. Next on gold, as you can see the gold is still ranging it's kind of symmetrical triangle pattern but it is not confirmed yet we can still get some range like this before the price will break up or break below. So that's what we need to look at make sure once the price break above these highs only then I'll start to look for my pullback bullish entry once we have broken above this high that is also a good signal that price now wants to push up and continue to push up in a trend now if we have a dramatic fall let's say we have some news event in that case I'm only looking at the downside at the major level of support which is right here which I'm going to mention once we are completely broken below so wait and see how it goes once we are broken above or below only then I'll start to look for my trend confirmation and take my possible trades wait and see not taking any gold trades at this point next one we have crude oil it's now broken above these highs so I'm not looking at head and shoulder patterns anymore so I'm going to remove these lines from it so all I'm looking at bullish engulfing entry so at this point a nice breakout of the out of this box pullback bullish engulfer if you are my student you know what entry condition is that that pushed up nice entry condition nice target has been hit according to my pullback entry rules it is not a valid pullback entry or not a valid condition in case you're wondering but i want to see some more pullback above 50 ema followed by bullish engulfer if we have that we are good to go long as price has just made a new high 
right here and then all i want to see a bullish condition that must be above 50 ma anywhere above 50 ma once we have that i'm only going to go long for crude oil till we are in the next level of major resistance which is right up there but for that we need to look for the condition and ride along with the trend once we have a good condition we are good to go long now at this point as now price is above the zone and broken above the zone we can still use the fibonacci levels something like this now aggressive entry can be 50 percent retracement with a buy limit order take profit can be 1.618 retracement stop loss can be below this pattern that is something for the aggressive traders but initial targets can be 180 r as well so that's what i'll be looking at for crude oil if you are aggressive traders otherwise pullback entry is something i'm personally looking at and also do not take my words on it everything here is my personal opinion nothing should be taken as any sort of trading advice so that's it for commodities guys hope you're getting value if yes hit the like button for me subscribe if you're new so that we can all trade together and trade efficiently hope you trade green i'll see you guys in the next video till then take care